someone, oh, I wanna be somebody to someone, oh, I never had nobody and no road home, I wanna be somebody to someone, and if the sun starts set and the sky goes cold, and if the clouds get heavy and start to GB. It's Maya and Alina and this is the last student interaction of the school year so we're gonna be asking people what are their summer plans. Let's go! Sea lunch! Sea lunch! I've actually never experienced oh, it is East lunch in my life before so this is my first time seeing East lunch. She has never been to an East lunch before. I've always filmed student interactions so I've been to like all of these. Drake? 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 <laughs> Like wood, like wood. Tristan, yeah. what are your summer plans? My birthday is on next month. I can be 17. Woo! Okay. What are your summer plans? <clears throat> um, basketball, sleeping, and making money. Here comes the money. Here we go. Make that money. Bye. Bye. Tommy, yeah. Tommy, come over here. Tommy. What are your summer plans? Shoot, hoop, and get money. <laughs> I have some concerts. Oh, I'm going to Young Life Camp in New York for a week. No phone. Um, working. Yeah. Go back to my home country. Baseball. Yeah. Okay, y'all. Okay, great. Let's. I'm gonna work. And play soccer and hang out with that cutie and that cutie. Ladies, the gentle hands. What are your plans this summer? Uh, football practice and working. What about you guys? Uh, football. Football working. You're not doing either of those, I think. <laughs> no, you're not doing none of them either. What are your plans this summer? Football, lacrosse, and working. Uh, football, lacrosse, and working. <laughs> hey, I think I know you. All right. What's going on? So. The question is, bro, what are you doing for summer? Uh, can I take the mic? Uh, so basically, um, at football camps, you know, I'm trying to grind, I'm trying to go D1, you feel me? Uh, it's the process, the journey. I'm going to start a YouTube channel. Stay tuned, you feel me? Yeah, that's pretty much it, man. Yeah, get at him for the haircuts, too. The haircuts. <laughs> Here are the do's and don'ts for final exams. Don't be unorganized when studying. Do be organized. Don't stay up late. Do get good sleep before finals. Don't forget to charge your Chromebook. Do charge your Chromebook. Don't forget to eat breakfast. Do eat breakfast before finals. Don't be late to class. Do be on time. Don't spend your weekend partying. Do study for finals over the weekend.
Many Grambling residents and visitors have seen the Ezra Perry Center. Not everyone knows what secrets it hides. While two thirds of the building are still used for learning, the top level has been made inaccessible to the common man. In this never before seen footage, we will unveil the hidden truths of the Perry Innovation Center's third floor. There's many theories why the third floor was abandoned, but the true reason is still unknown. Why do you think they closed the third floor of Perry Center? I'm gonna be honest, I think it's just not safe up there anymore. It used to be back in the day, but our infrastructure, it's gone bad. I'm assuming it's probably haunted, probably gobs and ghouls up there, but realistically, I didn't see any, so maybe that's not true, but I think there's probably some ghosts up there. When I was in preschool, they all told me that there was a ghost up there that would haunt the halls and it would take you. Who is this ghost people are talking about? The man the school is named after, Ezra Perry. He died in 1983, five years before the third level of the school was abandoned. This has left many to theorize that the alleged haunting within those five years is the reason for abandon. The truth may never be known, but what is for sure is that some things are left better unexplored. We're making goodie bags for incoming GBTV students. We're gonna go deliver now. For you. I'm excited to be a part of GBTV. So it's gonna be a great time. Maya. Thank you. <laughs> we told him surprise. Goodbye, I'm done. Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, thank you. Oh, hi. No, I'm very excited. Yes, yeah. I'm, I'm thrilled actually. Awesome. Hang out with your bestie Max. The yeah, yeah. Oh, he talks about one. me. Yeah, yes, all the time. Dude, she's gonna give you like no phone. Oh, what's up? What? Hey, Max. Thank you. Are you excited? I am, I am. Oh, that's so cool. Um, <laughs> thank you. Thanks, Maya. Thank you. How do you feel about being in GBTV next year? Oh, I'm very excited for it. Hey. Welcome to GBTV. We're so excited to have her back. Are you excited? Yeah, I'm so excited. How do you guys feel about getting into GBTV? I feel good. You know, I've been thinking about this for a few years. I think it's going to be a great experience. I think we're going to have a lot of fun next year, and I think we have a good crew for a senior year. I'm just hyped. I'm ready to go. Yeah. GBTV2, baby. How do you feel about getting into the class? Um, I love the class. I love Mr. Nicholson. He's my favorite teacher. Um, I love having creative freedom, and I can't wait to be able to do it throughout the year. How do you feel about getting in the class for next year? excited to have you next year. How you feel about coming to the class next year? I feel good. Are you excited to come back? Oh, I am very excited. Are you, you going to do another rap for us? Huh? You going to do another rap for us? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Don't mention that. <laughs> okay. Yikes. Are you excited to be here next year? Yeah. Yeah, I'm excited to be here next year. Here goes this. We're excited to have you. Hi. It's a GBTV. Are you excited to be in the class next year? Of course I am. So ex I'm super excited. <laughs> How do you feel about being in GBTV next year? Oh no, I'm happy, excited. Get me on there. This is for you. Welcome to GBTV. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Are you excited to be in the class next year? I am. I feel great. I'm gonna make great videos. <laughs> Are you excited to be in the class next year? Yes, I'm so excited. <laughs>
So, come to the end of the year. Good for you. So you're one step closer to being out of high school, one step closer to the real world. I bet some of you are very happy about that information. Well, enjoy it while it lasts. Because it only gets worse from here. I, I, I had to... I had to reshoot this, so that's why I'm wearing different clothes. <laughs>